Hello students, we are doing circumference of circle chapter 16 from class 9th book of West Bengal Board of Secondary Education and we have completed till question number 5 in our previous video. So today we'll start from question number 6. Okay, if you find this video helpful, then please subscribe the channel and hit the like button. Now let's proceed to solve the questions from question number 6. So this is question number 6. Perimeter of a semi-circular field is 108 meter. Let us calculate the diameter of the field. So this is the question. We are asked to find the diameter of the semicircular field whose perimeter is 108 meter. Okay. First, let us understand that perimeter and perimeter and circumference are same thing. Okay. Circumference of a circle are same thing. Perimeter and circumference are same thing. So sometimes we call circumference and sometimes we call perimeter the same thing. Now to solve this question, let us draw a circle here. So this is a circle and we have a center here. Let us draw a diameter. Diameter means two times radius, isn't it? This part is one radius and this part is another radius. Radius plus radius will give us diameter. So the circumference or the perimeter of this circle is given by the formula 2 pi r, isn't it? Circumference or the perimeter of this circle is given by 2 pi r. So semi means half, isn't it? Semi means half divided by 2 means semi. So if I cancel this 2 and 2, I get pi r. Semi means half, okay? Semi means half. If I erase this part, second part, the length of this curved part, the length of this curved part is pi r, pi r, 2 and 2 cancels out, so pi r, pi r means the length of this curved part, plus, plus, length of this 2 radius, that is diameter, length of the diameter will give us perimeter of semicircular field or perimeter of semicircle, okay, perimeter of semicircle means length of the curved part plus length of the diameter length of the curved part is pi r plus length of the diameter is 2r okay i hope you got this now let's solve this question let the radius let the radius of the semi circular field B R meter radius of the semicircular field B R meter. Now it is given to us perimeter of the semicircular field is 108 meter, isn't it? So perimeter of semicircular field means pi r pi r pi r plus 2 r, isn't it? Pi r plus 2 r is 108 meter. Pi r means length of the curved part and 2r means length of the diameter. Pi r plus 2r is 108. This is from the question, according to question, okay, given. This is given to us. Now, if I take r common from this two term, if r is taken common, pi remains within the bracket plus r is taken common, so 2 remains within the bracket equal to 108 or r we have here pi means 22 by 7 plus this 2 equal to 108 or r into so we have 1 in the denominator of 2 we take the lcm of 7 and 1 lcm will be 7 so 7 ones are 7 that 1 into 22 will give us 22 plus 1 into 7 is the 7 7 into 2 is 14 okay equal to 108 or r into okay 22 plus 14 4 plus 2 is 6 2 plus 1 is 3 36 upon 7 equal to 108 or r equal to we have 108 in the right hand side so this 7 will go to the numerator by cross multiplication upon this 36 will go to the denominator 
So 12 1 is a 12, 12 3 is a 36. 12 9 is a 108. 3 1 is a 3, 3 3 is a 9, isn't it? Or we got the value of r equal to 3 into 7, that is 21 meters. So we got the radius of the semicircular field, isn't it? We got the radius. Length of the radius is 21 meter. Therefore, we are asked to find the diameter, isn't it? Therefore, the diameter diameter of the semi circular field is given by the formula 2r 2 into radius means diameter okay so 2 into r what is the radius we got the radius to be 21 meter so instead of r we write 21 2 into 21 this will give us 2 1 the 2 2 to the 4 42 meter so we were asked to find the length of the diameter of the semicircular field the length of the diameter is 42 meter okay i hope you got this now let's move on to the next question question number seven the difference between the circumference and the diameter of a wheel is 75 centimeter let us calculate the length of radius of this wheel so according to question the condition is if we subtract diameter from circumference okay if we subtract diameter from circumference circumference minus diameter will give us 75 difference between circumference and diameter means circumference minus diameter will give us 75 so we are asked to calculate the radius of the wheel okay we are asked to calculate the radius of the wheel so let's solve this question let the radius of the wheel be r centimeter so i'm supposing the radius of the wheel be r centimeter Circum circumference of the wheel circumference of the wheel equal to 2 pi r isn't it when radius is r circumference will be 2 pi r centimeter diameter of the wheel diameter of the wheel is given by the formula 2r twice radius okay radius multiplied by 2 will give us diameter 2r is the diameter so this is diameter and this is circumference according to question circumference minus diameter will give us 75 isn't it so from the condition from given condition given condition we have circumference minus diameter isn't it so circumference is 2 pi r circumference minus diameter is 2 r circumference minus diameter will give us 75 or we take 2 r common from these two terms okay 2 r is taken common so within the bracket 2r is outside the bracket this pi will remain within the bracket minus 2r is taken outside so 1 will remain within the bracket equal to 75 or 2r pi means 22 upon 7 minus 1 equal to 75 or 2r so we have 1 in the denominator of 1 we take the LCM of 7 and 1 LCM will be 7 so 7 1 just 7 so 1 into 22 is 22 minus 1 7 just 7 7 into 1 is 7 equal to 75 or 2 R equal to the 75 we have in the right hand side the 7 will go to the numerator by cross multiplication 7 from the denominator okay and 22 minus 7 22 minus 7 will go to the denominator by cross multiplication 22 minus 7 is 15 isn't it oh, sorry uh, 5 1 15 yeah 22 minus 7 is 15 now 15 ones are 15 15 4 is a 60 15 5 is a 75 okay so we have 2 r equal to 5 into 7 2 r equal to 5 into 7 so 2 r equal to 5 into 7 means 5 7 is a 35 or r equal to 35 upon this 2 will go to the denominator by cross multiplication so we divide 35 by 2 
35 by 2 means 17.5 isn't it 217 is 34 35 minus 34 is 1 put decimal here 0 25 is 10 17.5 therefore radius equal to 17.5 centimeter we were asked to find the radius of the wheel isn't it so we got radius is 17.5 centimeter therefore radius of the wheel radius of the wheel will equal to 17.5 centimeter okay question number eight in a race puja and jacker start to compete from the same point and same time on a circular track of length of diameter is 28 meter when puja finishes the race at the competition by four revolutions jacker is one revolution behind let us calculate how many meters is the length of the race and by how many meters puja beats jacker okay so let's understand the question first so let's see this is a circular track okay and this is the diameter of the circular track so center is here this is one radius and this is the other radius radius plus radius will give us diameter so let us suppose puja and zakir starts their race from this position and they run along this circular track okay when they finishes one revolution and comes back to the same position they complete one circumference completing one revolution is completing one circumference okay that is 2 pi into radius 2 pi r completing one revolution is one circumference we should keep this in mind okay puja and zakir started from this position and ran along this circular track and came back to the same position one revolution again started and came back to the same position second revolution third and the fourth when puja completes fourth revolution the race is complete isn't it so we can easily find the length of the race when diameter is given to us diameter is 28 meter this is given to us length of the diameter is 28 meter so let us suppose the radius of the circular field okay let the radius of the circular field circular field f i e l d field equal to r meter let the radius of the circular field be r meter therefore diameter means 2r this is given to us given 2r is the diameter r plus r will give us 2r 2r is the diameter and twice into radius our diameter is given to us diameter is 28 meter isn't it 28 meter length of diameter is 28 meter so length of diameter is given to us that is 28 meter so we can find radius from this relation r equal to 28 divided by 2 this 2 will go to the denominator 2 ones are 2 2 ones are 2 2 four are 8 so we got radius of this circular field 14 meter isn't it radius of the circular field is 14 meter circumference of the circular field therefore circumference of the circular field circumference of the circular field equal to 2 into pi into r 2 pi r circumference 2 pi r okay so 2 into pi means 22 by 7 into r r is the radius so we got radius 14 14 7 1 is 7 7 2 is 14 2 2 is 4 4 into 22 isn't it so 4 2 is 8 4 2 is 8 88 meter so circumference of this circular field is 88 meter which means if one completes one revolution if starting from this position running along this circular track comes back to the same position then 88 meter will be covered okay length of one revolution is 88 meter circumference means the one revolution length of one revolution that is 88 meter okay so puja completes the race by completing four revolutions puja completes the race by completing four revolutions which means length of the race is therefore 
length of the race is length of the race equal to in one revolution we can complete 88 meter so in four revolutions 4 into 88 that will give us 4 at the 32 2 3 in hand 4 at the 32 32 plus 3 is 35 isn't it 352 meter okay in one revolution puja completes 88 meter so puja completed the whole race in four revolutions means 4 into 88 4 into 88 is 352 meter so the length of the race is 352 meter okay now the second part of the question is how many meters is the length of the race and by how many meters puja bid jacket by how many meters puja bid jacket this is the second part of the question the first part is length of the race we are asked to find how many meters is the length of the race so length of the race is 352 meter second part of the question is how many meters puja bids jacket so puja bids jacket by one revolution isn't it when puja finishes the race at the competition by four revolutions jacket is one revolution behind jacket is one revolution behind which means puja bid jacket by one revolution isn't it therefore since okay since puja beat zakir by one revolution when puja completed the race by four revolutions zakir was one revolution behind which means puja beat zakir by one revolution which means one revolution is 88 meter therefore puja beat puja beat zakir by 88 meter okay 88 meter okay this was for today thank you so much if you find this video helpful then please subscribe the channel and hit the like button okay i'll upload the rest of the questions in the next video thank you